all right um barista maswell just dropped a video a trending video and um funny enough that video is going viral and that video is actually a very scary one how do i mean you know um i think that was um immediately after mazinam de Kano's last last year and that was on september 24th i guess so that um Nam the Kano's team visited Nam the Kano at DSS custody. Remember, I, I, I dropped a post, a, a video that went viral, where with with um video, with video evidence of his lawyers being, you know, rejected from entering um entering DSS um office to see Mazinam de Kano or DSS, you know, custody to see Mazinam de Kano. Now, fast forward to Exactly one month later, we've been hearing the side talks about, you know, Mazinam the Kano not being in DSS. We don't even know the, you know, the the current position of Mazinam the Kano. That is why, you know, I am totally disappointed in the so-called Mazinam the Kano's wife. But that is not my major issue. We'll talk about her later. Now, Maswell, Barista Maswell, just dropped another video yesterday when they went to see Mazanam de Kano. This time around, the DSS ofi officer who was at the entrance made it very clear to them that they cannot see Mazanam de Kano and they will not see Mazanam de Kano again. Now, the instruction is from the upper echelon. Let me use the word, the upper echelon. So the instruction is from the Oga at the top. Bishi, the former DSS boss, did his own. And we saw where it resulted him. Now, this new man, Ayodeji, or what did they call him, has come in and he wants to start his own tyranny on Mazanam de Kano. Let, let me tell you, let me make you people understand what we are actually dealing with. Mazanam de Kano is actually the only the only um client who is going um the only person who is handling a terrorism case currently that in that the nigerian government has failed you know to to give a lawyer so he's actually handling it without a lawyer that apart that apart we do not even know the current situation of Mazenam de Kano is as simple as that. So who knows what has actually happened to Mazenam de Kano? Who knows whether he's alive? Who knows whether he is safe? Nobody knows. What if Mazenam de Kano has been taken away from the DSS custody? What if Mazenam de Kano has been taken to another location? They've done it. We've seen, we've seen the Nigerian government do all kind of things, especially the DSS. Now, one of the news I dropped was that the court, the so-called court of competent jurisdiction in court, you know, demanded that um, the current DSS boss should be arrested because of Mazenam de Kano. But yet, nothing has actually been done. This is just, you know, the normal routine of playing hanker panky games you know with people messing messing around with people's head and all that we know what they want we know that they are all liars we know what they are actually working against we know that their major aim is to find a way to buy that man so from the video which i'll be dropping now from the video of barista maswell Nobody can categorically come out and say this is the situation of Mazen Nam de Kano. And that is the most fearful thing at this point in time. You know, most of you who have been fighting Simon Epa and Joko, see, uh, you people are, in fact, all of you are just mad. Because I think Simon Epa and Joko is the only person that has actually made Nigeria, you know, have a level of sanity and also remind the world what you know beer friends are going through in their own land honestly speaking 
if not for the emergence of Matt, uh, of um, the, uh, of Simon Ekwa and how he has been able to carry the whole mantle of leadership and Biafran uh, freedom, honestly speaking, I swear, nobody would have been mentioning the issue of Mazenam Dekanu. They would have done whatever they wanted to do with Onyendo Mazenam Dekanu. Let me tell you, remember that Shore was released. Remember that Sunday Ibehu was released. Their own case was wiped out. The big question is, why wasn't Mazanam Dekanu released? And I'm still asking another question. Who and where? Where exactly is Onyendo Mazanam Dekanu? This is what the France are asking because everybody is in total confusion. And honestly, there is fear in the land. Because if anything unto us should happen to Mazanam the Kano, we know what will be the outcome of the whole thing. But meanwhile, watch the video from Maswell and do not forget to share this video because this is the only way we can continue to raise our voice so that the world will know of the kind of atrocious things you know being done by this so-called government. Today, Monday, 23rd, Wednesday, 23rd day of October. We went to see him. The, that, the last one went there. The last one went there. They, they allowed us inside at the receptionist and the, at the reception and the access to park outside. But today, they outrightly rejected us from coming inside. They mounted their people on the, at the gate and the instruction is that none of the Carlos lawyer should be allowed to come inside. So not even to see him. So the reason for that, I don't know. I don't know whether whether Nandekalu is still alive. I don't know whether he's still with them. I don't know where they have taken him to. Tomorrow being 24th day of September will make it complete one month. Because I saw him last. Tomorrow being 24th, 24th day of October will make it one month. Because I saw him last on uh, on uh, September 24th. Since that, when, when uh, he, he came to court last. Since that time up to now, no communication whatsoever. This is, the, this is the document I, I, I want to come and show him in respect of preparing the, the, his documents, uh, the things that uh, uh, we feel that we can file in court. But now, they did not allow us access. Nandekalu is the only person now, as I speak now, uh, that is facing a uh, criminal trial without a lawyer. No dates for the court in the, in the Federal High Court, no access to his lawyer, so when I left to DSS, I decided to come and see Attorney General. This is Minister of Justice. I'm making this video from the Minister of Justice. But I was unable to see the Minister for Justice because I don't see why we should have this building here that called the Minister of Justice. If we should have this, this building here, they will have Minister for Justice. And this injustice is happening in a country. It means that we are in Banana Republic. So, and uh, the actions that we should not be coming. That's what the DSS guy told that we should not be coming. Uh, that we are not going to see Nana Kala again. I even said that's what they did. So I said for what? So that is the position for now. I will continue to update you. Uh, we have five, we have commenced uh, content uh, uh, proceedings against the new director of DSSS. So let's see how it will do. Thank you. We'll continue to update you. Criminality, violence, and kidnapping in the name of Nam Dekano. In the name of who? In the name of who? He, she said, just to tag him to their crimes. See the video below. Nam Dekano said, you are not doing it for him. Who is doing who? And who is doing what? When he talked about war, he means a mental war. <laughs> Onye ka na gori. Onye ka na gori. Wild people everywhere. Mazinam de Kano said on a live interview with the one man called Rudolph. Rudolph, the formal employee of Sahara Reporters. Rudolph is an Igbo man in America. Interviewed Mazin Namdekano, and Mazin Namdekano said 
I am a student of contemporary history and I have not seen, I have not seen any country that gain independence through peaceful means. He said it in the public. Soliciting for arms to fight for his freedom in America when he visited World Ebo Congress. How many of you are aware of this? These things are in the public. I am not making up any story. <laughs> eh? I'm not making up any story. So, madam, you can't confuse or we are wiser than you. Your brain is just like a burokoko. We are wiser than you. Apart from listening to Mazin Namde Kano, we already wise. The, 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 the knowledge is in a uh, God gave, gave it to us. I, I did not become wise because I was listening to Mazin Namde Kano, no. Because there are many people who are listening to, also listening to Mazin Namde Kano like I did, yet they, they know nothing. They are not wise. The knowledge is not there. So God created us and gave us the knowledge from birth. So we, be, we, we, as we grow up, we sharpen it. We sharpen it. We make it more sharper. As we see things in life, pass through lives and challenges, and also, you know, see many things, including listening to Mazinam Dekano as well, then our brain became more sharp, more, more sharp, it became sharper than even <laughs> as uh, never before. So we did not become wise overnight. No, the wisdom has been there from beginning. <laughs> you understand? A lot of people, especially those following the criminals in the DOS West Africa Limited, they were all listening to Mazin Namdekano. <laughs> they were all listening to Mazin Namdekano. Like us. So why are they, are they just behaving because of the money that was paid to them or are they behaving because they are idiots and ignorance? The question is left for the, of course, the Delilah to answer. Now, she continued. She said, when he talked about war, when Mazinam Dekanu talked about war, he means a mental war, <laughs> mental war. <laughs> oh, look who it twist our brain. <laughs> oh, look who it twist our brain. When he talked about Somalia being better than Nigeria, he means it economically. Ah, enokwa. And I am a raw all this while. Obruzi and Waban said the Uche 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 Delilah. Ace from village, Popo Popo United Kingdom. Now, Kuzizira and Ifen Nam the Kanogarai. Waban say Uche Uche Amona village. A si village, Popria. Mazin Nam the Kano was like God to this idiot. Mazin Nam the Kano was the God of it, of this idiot. Where a Kereba Amorogo Amorogo be Kebe Galu school Keba Amorogi Kebe Galu school Pago be away Milonia was your father a Milonia or is your father even till now is your father a Milonia if not you giving part of the proceed you sold uh, from your husband uh, uh, betrayer from your uh, betrayal uh, from the betrayal, betrayal of your husband if not giving your father part of the proceed. Is your father a millionaire? I'm going to get a in well a passport to be fair. No, I'm as in the canoe. Do you have an international passport? Not do you. Did you have an international passport before you marry Mazin? Before Mazin, I'm the canoe married you. He is where potazina a cousin. And if I am, I can go malo one of you. Now, she said, Nam Dekanu said, you do not work for him. Of course, I have addressed this before. We are not working for Mazin Nam Dekanu. I myself, I am not working for Mazin Nam Dekanu. How can I work for, I am not even working for Mazin Samaneba. I am not working for the prime minister. 
I am not working for anybody. I am working for my freedom and the freedom of my people who are Biafrans at large. I am not working for anybody because nobody pays me salary. <coughs> How can Mazi Samaneba be working for Mazi Namdekan when Mazi Namdekan is not paying him salary? I don't understand how it works. How do you reason, my people? How do these people reason? I don't work for anybody. I am supporting the Prime Minister Mazi Samonekma because he is fighting for my freedom. And I am fighting for my freedom and the freedom of my people who are Biafran people. I am not working for anybody. Because nobody employed me. Nobody employed me. I am not working for anybody. So how can you come on Twitter and in the public and tell me Namdekano said you do not work for him? Who is working for Mazi Namdekano? Nobody's working for him. The prime minister does not work for anybody. He is working for his own freedom and the freedom of his people who are Biafran people. In case you are not aware, you better know it today. All sign above all sign Chinese collective effort to the freedom of our people and our land. Obu ni me pay business. E ga pota, e da ne pota wa boy. Mo bo, you know, um, you employed somebody. That person will be working for you. You, e da ne na kwe a salary. Or, no no me agreement. Or, sa avoge for four years, five years, six years. Sa to lawyer. But when there is nothing like this, then, how can you come and say you are not working for me when I did not employ you? <coughs> now he said, she said, You are a criminal, oh go abuzi judge. You are the judge. Go abuzi on conclude where confirm. You are a criminal, and your fellow criminals are operating under your umbrella. Nam Dekanu said, those faffing about and seeking relevance with his name, buying and kidnapping people are not working for him. Of course, Ifanye Jofo and Benjamin Madubugu, who have criminal gang who kidnap people for ransom in Biafra land, are not working for Mazin Nam Dekanu. Never. They can never work for Mazin Nam Dekanu. Yes. Now, he, she said, Nam Dekanu said, he leads IPOB, and IPOB is one family, but you attack that same IPOB, claiming they no longer exist. In your little, uh, 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 in your little P-shaped mind. We have never stopped saying Mazin Nam Dekanu is the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. We have never for one day stopped saying that. He remains the leader of indigenous people of Biafra, but the IPOB led by Chike Dozieha is not the IPOB of Mazin Namdekanu. He even said it in the public, in the courtroom. He said it. Mazin Namdekanu said it. <coughs> you know, Mazin Namdekanu said it. Now, she said, IPOB is one family all over the world. Nigeria government needs to understand that Igbos value lives, and that is why no neocolonialist, no neocolonialist agent recruited to counter our peace and freedom that are Igbo. The ancient land will not make mad. They are already mad. Who teach you are mad already? And the, the madness which is coming, keep Azua, your video will soon be on the social media. <laughs> Uchechi, your video is about to, you know, uh, trend on social media. Emalokwa, oboro ne yango, angunsi, jakwang onsi noge. Emalifi, emongi game koyo noge, before neku, because emalebe nka yano weku. Before the Prime Minister of the Biafra Republic government in exile will start calling you a kona kona or confirm go something. Oh, we give for Jiraka. Open in case Biafrans are not aware, listen. The time we began the fight 
of DOS against the DOS, the Prime Minister was still telling us to calm down. He was telling us that if the DOS council sit at home, that means they still have more plans that is that are even bigger than sit at home, which is coming. Until all given in Doliana or Jida or the evidence, or where Potanike or where Potanike the time we began to fight a Jofo. It happened on my home. I'm the one that hosted the program. I hosted the program. Mazi Simon ever told us, you cannot fight a Jofo on my platform. <laughs> Everything I'm telling you happened in the public. <laughs> you know, he told us that was the that was where the whole problem started. I hosted the program. Nelly of Febu was there. This idiot in Simana Abareka Kwampuram was there. And all of them, Ma Feto, Gala, Boat, Kenkozo, Ndidu, they were all there. Ma Aziz Amlepa told us, you cannot fight a Jofo on my platform. And he left. He left the live broadcast. It happened live. How many of you are aware of what I'm saying? Because I like when I'm talking. People should confirm it in the comment section. How many of you are aware of what I'm saying? I personally hosted the, 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 the live program. I was the conductor. <laughs> you know? So, but when he had all the evidences he wanted, oh, was Sophia, thank you. They were all there. <laughs> they were all there when he had all the evidences that he wanted to have because this man called Mazi Samanepa cannot criticize you or fight against you without evidence I want Uchechi to know that Ikoye Jugonon on a very big mess before Mazi Simonepa will start calling her Kuna Kuna <laughs> <laughs> we are talking about somebody that I know. I know how he, he, he does his thing. The moment he gathered all the evidences against the job for boom, or potanike, the same was you could potanike against the OS or potakwanike against the job for, and my brothers and sisters, the result all the way in a public. The result were all the way in a public. Are you paying attention? So, any kind of gagodini look at Jinaka, but I want you to know now this UCH is finished. This UCH for she's finished. Even though Gabby don't now fight to quite this UCH earlier on, long ago, I think that was in 2022 or even late 2021. This same Mazi Samanepa was busy, you know, fighting for her. That is to show when anybody the obiye the ocha, on anybody obiye the ocha, akaya the ocha, that person can never fall. I'm telling you, if an agwagebo pure, everything I'm telling you is gospel. When we, we when people were fighting this same woman, Nelo Febu them over Sophia, they were calling her shawo. On a live broadcast, <laughs> Mazi Simonetta was busy protecting her. After this man called, there's that pastor that I interviewed like two or three times. Um, what's his name? Can somebody remind me? Indinogen, if I name, can you remind Maxwell, Pastor Maxwell? After uh, Mazi Simonetta was busy conducting prayer sections with Pastor Maxwell and this same woman, bringing in this woman to join the prayer, you know, section and, uh, you know, a kind of broadcast. He was busy protecting this same woman. This same woman today that want to bring him Kebuoya. Mwaya Cholui Kebuos Mazi Samanepa Nketa Nkechi. 
this same as this Samonepa was busy protecting her when people were calling her shower. Because Mazi Samanepa can never fight you unless two things happen. First of all, you must be the one to fight him. And he will warn you several times. If you do not stop, then he will fight back. That is number one. Then number two, he will have evidence to fight you. That is what I have noticed about him. He doesn't fight when others are fighting. He doesn't fight because my, you know, my group or my people or my followers are fighting. No, he fights when he has every proof to fight you. So that when he's fighting, he, he will come for you and you are finished. Once he comes for you, you are finished. You are gone. People are wondering, why is it that whenever Mazi Samonekwa make an exposition about somebody, that person will finish, is, is, is gone? Because he doesn't do explanatory exposition. That is the same thing I told Nelly of Febu and the idiot Nsima and Kedafaya. Kedafa and 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 Kedafa when they were ganging up to start fighting Mazi Samanep, I told them, look, Biafrans do not listen to explanatory expo exposition. Nobody have time for exp explanatory exposition. You don't have any evidence of whatever you are claiming against the man. So allow him to be, because if you ever fight him, you are, you, you, you are gone, because nobody will listen to you. I told them, pump and play. And they did not listen to me. They went on to fight him, and that was their end. <coughs> that was their end. So, let's continue first. According to her, she said, we have what we call unsala, of course, which in each email, email lawyer, and then so I omega panoge already. We understand the meaning and the importance of Obara. <coughs> Now, therefore, we will continue to counter you. Therefore, we will continue to counter you. O go ne de ifa. O maro no nyo ne de li fe jide go video ya. Wahala bi la bicycle. Wahala. O go ne na fe le ono. O maro no nyo na fe le de ono e jide go video ya na ka. Ne, 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 on no kwana, ebo, na pale, one, 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 ni ena, mo ya mo. Ona abari. Chai. Wadiegu. Onye no no wakubaka yoto. This message today, for our people, e no lo no wa kubaka goto. She said, there is no way, <clears throat> she said, there is no way, your recruit can tag Nam the Kanu to his crimes, it will not happen. When you are all done re raving mad on the internet with your computer, with your computer generated imbecile imbeciles, the fact that na ane we obode we kwa nukum mado, nuk we kwa nukum mau mandi mandi o mandi o timbu remains untwatted. Umu koko. Kimpa. Kimpa wedisi. Now, she attached this very video, and I want to play the video. After playing this video, I will show you something else. Oh, no. What I need to see on is I'll leave. 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 I love my people very much and they know it. I don't want all this, anybody involved. I've been hearing about idiots talking all over the place. Some fools trying to be relevant because of Biafra or trying to use my name to gain relevance. Did you hear that? Trying to use my name to gain relevance. Are you paying attention? Trying to use my name to gain relevance now let us begin because okwa diego a lot of people do not understand let us begin first of all 
I want you to know that Mazin Namdekanu knows Mazin Simone by very, very well. Pay attention. Number one, Mazi Simonekpa has become relevant already before joining the Biafra struggle. I want you to know this. Pay attention, I'm taking you somewhere. Mazi Simonekpa is already a politician, a well recognized politician, which we have seen videos and his campaigns back in the days, which he has held various offices in Finnish politics serve the Finnish people diligently. We all know this, no doubt. Anybody can, nobody can doubt it unless you are doubting yourself. And all these things, Mazinam de Kano is aware of it. Again, a lot of people are not aware that Mazi Simon Epa is also a prince. Come to work here today. <laughs> you don't know. You are not aware. I'm very certain you don't know. Maybe few of you listening to me now know. Many people are not aware. You know, sometimes so you like when the fedo puro pundi is a potane me broadcast. You be one. You be thinking that he just love to dress like that. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. He is a crown prince, just like Mazin Nam de Kano, Empire Boyze. Like Israel, Israel Kano, Empire Mazi Simonepa was a king. The same way the father of Mazi Nam the Kano was a king. He is a crown prince. You know, this thing he has not said it. He doesn't come out to boast in, on social media. That's one thing I like about him. He just behaves like Mazin Amdekano sometimes. Mazin Amdekano does not come to show you how because I'm a prince and this and no. A lot of people are not aware that if Mazin Simon ever decide to live uh, to live abroad to the other because he for Bona Basaliala abroad, on our befa ikubeyu bueze, nampaya bueze. He's a crown prince. A lot of people are not aware. I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. He is a crown prince, just like Mazin Amdekano is. Forget what I name if I be afraid to talk or you know why you quote us to a No, he's a crown prince originally. Obrono, if I need to know, Obrono, you want to know. He is a prince in Paya Bueze. You understand? So he has already become relevant before joining Biafra Liberation. Now, you think Mazin Namdekano was talking to Mazi Simon? But no, you, are, you don't know. Mazin Namdekano can never use that word, using my name to be relevant, knowing fully well who Mazi Simon is. Both here in Biafra land, in his, home, in his hometown, and in Finland. So he will never Apart from being the chairman of Igbo Union in Finland, those things and all that. No, leave those ones alone. Originally, here in Biafra land, in Igbo land here, he is a prince, a crown prince, and he is a politician in Finland, a well-recognized politician. So he's not seeking for relevance. Now, those that Mazin Amdekan is talking to, who are seeking relevance, with his name and Biafra name. Who is China Sangohu? Let us begin. <laughs> because the, the, the Delilah shared this video thinking that uh, Mazin Namdekano is talking to Simon Epa. No. <coughs> Do you know who is China Sangohu? Do you know? Is he only for Bo? China Sangohu only for Bo? Only for Bo? He is a nobody. Onweri forbu okwa kedi fana kwa ya kuwe chuko galona taofu before Mazin Amdekano we bido biafra you know agitation oma batani ike ofure begono. Who is Chike Dozie? Honorable relevance ka Chike Dozie na acho ojuwe bani into biafra. 
on y est boutique et dosier. On y est kachik et dosier. Chik et dosier. Using the name of Mazenam de Kano and Biafra. Seeking relevance. On y est be ma powerful. Ma powerless. There's nothing like powerful. Who is a ma powerless? <coughs> on y est ke ma powerless. <coughs> Okay, Balo, you read the other time, few years ago. I born a record for why I'm Ghana. Who be my powerless? Onye ke my powerless, bo. As if that is not enough, right? Onye bu ifa ni e jor for before Mazinam de Kana Olia. Onye bu ifa ni e jor for Osiabe we pata. Okay, from Paya na video. Okay, ni from Paya na video. Didn't we see his father? Onyebu Benjamin Madubugu. O siebe webia. Onyebu mpaya. Onyebu ya. O kwa biya frako ja cho relevans. Ke do onyebu Benjamin Madubugu. Onyebu o forma. Who claim to be the chairman of uh, communication. Of IPOB. Onyebu o forma. Ndini ni na ruru di OS olu onye mo fa where do they come from who who do they have any name are they not seeking for relevance with APOB amazinam de kanu eh are they not seeking relevance onye mo fa now let's continue i don't want it. i don't want any killings no kidnapping all this nonsense are alien to us as a people i don't know where these animals came from they are taking advantage of the fact that i'm in detention but it will, it will soon end they, they, they know what ipob stands for ipob is one family any idiot trying to leech on ipob trying to use the name of ipob trying to subvert the will of the people our principles and our core values that person has a lot to contend with when the time comes. Did you hear him? Any person who is using the name of IPOB. Are you here? This is clear. This is very, very clear. Let me take that again. <laughs> Let me take it again. The name of IPOB, trying to subvert. Is one family. Any idiot trying to leech on IPOB, trying to use them of IPOB, trying to subvert the will of the people. Are... Did you hear him? Anybody using the name of IPOB, trying to subvert the will of the people, trying to subvert the will of the people. The will of the people which have given the prime minister and the government in exile the go ahead order to declare Biafra, which Mazinam the Kano prophesied we will declare Biafra when the people give us the mandate. And is my voice coming out clear? Are you hearing me? Let me know in the comment section now because I'm not sure if you are hearing me. Trying to subvert the will of the people, the same will of the people which we are riding on, on, on now, that have given the Biafra government the go ahead order to declare Biafra on the 2nd of December. Which Mazin Namdekano prophesied, we will declare Biafra when the people give us the mandate. The same government that the people gave the mandate is the same government that Mazin Nam Dekano prophesied that we shall form a government. He is not telling you, you must wait until after when I'm out, then we'll form God. No, he didn't know what tomorrow brings. Mazin Nam Dekano did not know what tomorrow brings. But he prophesied that we shall form a government. How many of you heard him? How many of you heard him? Did you hear Mazin Nam de Khan when he said, we shall form a government? Did you hear him? Did you hear him say that? <laughs> oh, say to go. Oh, say to go. So who is using the name of IPOB? Because last time I checked, 
last time I checked, we have left that IPOB name for the criminals who claim to be the owners of IPOB. We are operating under the government of Biafra, known as Biaoji, i.e. Bridge, the Biafra Republic government in exile. Last time I checked, so who is he talking to? Who is claiming to be IPOB, IPOB? Who, 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 who? And remember, this video was made just a couple of days ago, the last court appearance of Mazinam Dekano, which Mazinam Dekano is fully aware that Biafra people now have a government that he prophesied a couple of years ago. <laughs> he knows everything we are doing today, Mazinam Dekano is aware of it. Mazin Namdekani is aware that we are no longer answering uh, or operating under the name of IPOB. He knows. Mazin Namdekani is aware. So for him to say anybody using the name of IPOB to commit crime, are you paying attention? He knows whom he's talking to. Oh, man, Agwa. Oma no na Benjamin in Madubugu. Oma no na agwa Chike Dozie. Oma no na agwa China Sangoro. Okwa Febugo. Febugo they are, uh, 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 they are one of their henchmen. <laughs> Febugo, one of their henchmen. Okay, Chuku Gwonha. They have pied him. The criminals have pied the, one of their henchmen. Amado mi fene selofa. Amado mi fene selofa nke bazwa. Maybe onye kan wa choge la pofa. Where she are on social media. Fabu Syria, she are on social media. Na Facebook here. And make you go. The so called Biafra Land Coordinator. Biafra Land Coordinator. The Biafra Land Coordinator. Oh, Kafara. When you go so much. Oh, to our Kafara. When I so much. And make you go. If on your own. I'm on your own. I I'm that man up alone. The old Burundi Waka, you know, that came before with the order of China Samuel. Hey, Chuku, you have quite a lot of things, my brothers, my brothers and sisters. Chuku, you have a lot of things. I'm telling you. Now, let us see. Remember the headline. The headline of this broadcast says, Uche Chidilaila write Nigeria government to kidnap Simon Eba the same way they kidnapped her ex-husband, Mazinam Dekano. That is the headline. And we have not even come to the, you know, the, the, the letter. We are coming to the letter. We haven't come to the letter. We haven't come to the letter. We will come to the letter, but not now. Let's continue. When we are done exposing order of her criminality and idiocy, then we will come to the letter. Mad people everywhere. Umokoko. Now, there is something else she did. <laughs> you, you will be mad on this.